In the last video, you learned how to use variable inside the playbook. So we have this playbook uh, to install a web package and install firewall package and start the services and open some ports, etc. So you learn how to use this variable. Let's say you want to install a different package. Let's say instead of HTTPD, because uh, right now you are using web package as HTTPD. Let's say if I want to try Nginx or some different uh, web server or some different option. So how you can do that? So you want to try with a different package. Let's say I want to install Nginx instead of um, HTTPD. So either you have to edit the watch file inside a watch file or the playbook and change the parameters. Instead of that, you have an option called extra watch. So you check Ansible playbook then minus s so you will see options like extra words means you can pass some extra variables inside the playbook so these variable values will be override uh, with the variables inside your playbook or the included words file let's try this one ansible minus uh, a playbook then set.yml then use e then web underscore package for underscore package equal to nginx and web underscore service you want to start the nginx service let's try this one see you can already see it's already replaced because we put httpd but now it's using nginx wonderful so you didn't change anything instead instead you while while running the playbook you replace the variable values so let's verify the details now so we will log into ssh node 1 sudo yum list installed stpd ok no package nginx good we have sudo yum sudo system system ctr status nginx good so instead of changing the playbook or editing the playbook or what's while you can simply pass the extra variables or override the variables so remember this let's say i want to install httpd back what will happen because http will be installed but it will conflict because you know the http port is already used by nginx so i want to remove that so let's remove the nginx package and reinstall httpd back ansible minus okay ansible nodes minus m m then minus a name equal to nginx you want to remove this so state equal to absent so remember to give that become because yeah we are removing the package wait for the operations to complete completed okay it's no order we try again here no package good now we have to install back again and spill my display book because i am not giving anything because the by default the words files contains the http value so ansible my display book then rodiaml okay good so this is very simple you know how to replace the variable using extra words option uh, why we are using extra words option because there are so many cases you want to pass variables externally rather than editing a words file or the playbook one of the best example is this you saw how to replace the value of a package or let's say you want to replace the value of the port let's say we have site.yml we have http port right let's say if you want to open different ports like uh, 8080 or 443 you can give the value here and open the port automatically another example is right now we are hard coded our host names here okay notes what will happen if i give the playbook to someone else my colleague or someone they will just execute and it will run against the notes again means if the nodes is not there uh, it will throw error but if the node is available and if it's working it will just do the work on the maybe the production nodes etc we want to avoid that 
what you can do you can give a variable name here called nodes i'm not defining these nodes anywhere instead i am just telling okay what what will happen if, what will happen if if i execute it right now it throw error because the host is an invalid value okay means we have to pass something so what i will do stars then nodes equal to or nodes name don't confuse with nodes is a variable name and nodes is the inventory group name now it's installing on nodes okay let's say i want to execute this only on node 1 so what you can do is only on node 1 or node 2 so the playbook will be installed only on node 1 or node 2 or or maybe the web servers or different uh server group so you can override like this so these are the some of the use cases uh you can try with extra words okay hope uh, you got some idea on the variables and overriding the variables using extra words and that's it for the demo and um, see you next time with another video please see the full uh youtube playlist for the ansible series and um, do not forget to subscribe to this youtube channel thank you uh, see you next time with another video